Hey y'all, I am outside and I'm going to see if I can adjust this phone down so you can see what I'm going to do. Now, let me tell you, I made these little mini cheesecakes yesterday. Mmm. They are so good. Preppy kitchen. Um. Oh. It called for pecans, but of course I use walnuts all the time. But let me show you what I'm going to do. Okay. Can y'all see these babies? This one's big. I've had it outside. These mother-in-law tongues do really, really good outside. At least here in California, they do. And then I've got this other one. Now, the big one used to be in the house, too. But I just, I just brought it outside. And now this one, can you see? There's a baby. Now that one broke off right there, y'all. It made me so sad. But it's okay. So I'm going to repot these two in Move over, baby. Yep, you guessed it. Magenta pots. I love that color so much. And so I also love, can you tell these pots? One of them is a little bit wider, but it's squatty. And I like that. Now I've got a neighbor, y'all. And, um, let me see if I turn a little bit. Yeah. I've got a neighbor, and he's got, we think he's a drug dealer. But he's got this huge pot outside, and it's full of this. Y'all seen them, I know, in the nurseries and stuff, or even at Walmart has them. And they're huge. So they do really good. So I'm going to do that. And let me see. Can y'all see my little pit? The um, thing is, this thing is in the way. I don't know what you call them. Anyway, I'm going to plant my flowers in the pit today. And, um, you know, it's... Uh, this is crazy. I have to keep doing this. Y'all are crooked, but that's okay. Um, oh, I gotta show you something. Oh my gosh. Look. Remember Mr. Potato? Look at him. Now that's not even the crazy part. Let me see if I can do. Look at that. Look at those roots. That's not really the part you need. I think it's this part, oops, this part up here. But anyway, um, he finally told me, go on and do what you want to do with me because I know you're going to do it anyway. So I said, okay. So I stuck him in a little dish and um, and then I kind of forgot about him. But, but look at that. It's like he's got a big old mustache or something. He forgot his clippers, you know, to keep those nose hairs out and those ear hairs out. So I'm going to, um, I'm going to do those two plants. And then when the sun gets a little bit further over, then I'm going to plant those. Now, let me show you what I have to deal with 
in the front. Hold on, let me get you out. Oh, okay. Y'all almost saw my nose here. Oh, wait a minute. I forgot my last bite of my cheesecake. Hold on. Mmm. Mmm. Man, I wish y'all could come have some of this with me. I'm sorry, I'm talking with my mouth full, but at least you can't see me. Do you see how that kind of looks like a... I don't know, does that look like a heart to you? Kind of beautiful is what it is. Oh, I got to show y'all something. Do you think that I have so many projects going because I'm scatterbrained? Or do you think that I'm scatterbrained because I have a lot of projects? You see these? Remember these? Sweetie, I kind of made fun of these when you sent them to me. But you know what? Oh, in case y'all can't tell. Um, I'm sorry. Now I need something to drink. Um, these are tweezers. They're surgical tweezers. They're so big. And I have some that have a little, uh, you know, groove on the end. But I tell you what. I use these things. I'm trying to get on the ground. Okay, I'm down here. Um, I use these things all the time. Now look. Let me see. You see how I can get under there and get those little pieces? I just have to look. I don't know if y'all even saw me do that. Where is my tweezer? There it is. Y'all, this is not working out. It's too sunny. You can't be too sunny. Hello, sweetie. I'm going to work on you pretty soon, I promise. But, these tweezers are awesome when you have to get down in a plant. See, this is not good. When you have to get down in a plant and get a piece that's fallen this is not working at all. Okay, that's terrible. I don't, whoa, I sat down on my ground cover. This looks really bad, but let me tell you, it is, it's growing and it's spreading. And I have a few more pieces in the back that I'm gonna move up here. But I want you guys to see, see, I can't see because the sun is out. But can y'all see this root goes, I mean, I don't know how far it goes under there, but it goes down here. It's all the way over here. Look at this. This is all root. Now, poor Jerry. He has had an axe, he's had a saw, he's had a chainsaw, and I mean, it has been crazy. So, he did get enough. Now, see down here, this is so, this was so easy to dig out and all of that. And, um, but this, it's gonna, Hey, y'all don't need to look at my feet. I don't know if you can tell, but he made a curve, cut that root out, and now here is the part. See, I need to be able to run my board through here, my um, border, and then this is all 
root right here. I hacked at it and hacked at it yesterday. So, I'm going to have to be a little creative when I try to plant. Now, look. Why did I dig down that far? I have no clue. Now, this, I was going to take my border down to here and then run it over here to the fence. That is not going to work. This is all solid root. So, I'm going to run my border here. Why did I dig down so deep? I don't know. I guess it's because there was no root there. But, I've got good soil. I sifted buckets of it yesterday. I've got good soil. And, um, I'll mix it with some, uh, potting soil. And then I'm going to take all my pots. And this side will be really easy. But this side... I'm going to have to really get creative here. I might have to... See, there's... I don't know if y'all can see. There's this... Oh, by the way, I checked it out. And wood chips are not good for plants. So I cleaned this out. And I'm going to do a little bit more... But I clean this out. Y'all never want to take me out to eat with you. Look at those hands. They're clean right now. But anyway, um, I'm going to have to, of course, fill that hole in. I just couldn't quit digging underneath there. It's just crazy. Look. It looks like a little troll could live under there. Maybe I should get one. You know those little trolls? I should get a couple of them and put them down in there. I, that's what I said. I'm going to have to be a little bit creative. Now, right here is big enough for a small succulent. And what I'm going to do is I am going to take my drill with a big drill bit. And... To get my border to go through here, I'm going to try that as well. At least I could sink a spike down there. Not a spike. It's, what do you call those things that helps stabilize your border? Anyway, this is... A real project. Now, a sane person would fill this all in and go down and spend $20 and get another flat of ground cover and put it all in here and call it good. But I'm not a sane person. Hazel, did you go potty? Good girl. Let me not step in it. There we go. So anyway, y'all, that's a big, this is a big project. And I just want to get my pickaxe out and do some damage to that. Now, I'm telling you, these are the only seeds that have come up like crazy. And, of course, they would be on Steph's side of the fence. But anyway, that's what I'm going to do. And I'm, I'm going to start with repotting over here. I came out here to answer some comments this morning and sat on my glider. It's so clean. And um, I'm going to have to decide where I am going to put Shrek. Because he's got to be in a space where his roots can go down. So that probably means up there in front of the van somewhere. Ooh, FedEx. 
I'm going to tell y'all something. I'm going to be honest. I always try to be honest with you guys. And I'm going to tell you, I miss the Amazon trucks. <laughs> I really do. I do. I miss those Amazon trucks. So anyway, y'all, I got a lot of stuff to do. And I have these blocks left over. And at first, I thought I was going to go around like that. But I'd have to dig up stuff. And I, don't, I just don't want to do that. So, I think I'm going to use them um, up front. And let's see. See where I've got my... Look at my boogie. Ah, look at her. She's doing so good. And I decided I'm going to plant that jade too. And here's a day lily that was in the back. And it was drowning. And um, so I'm going to plant that too. I am so abundantly blessed, y'all. Oh, but I'm going to tell you. Here, Miss Hazel, you got to get down. You heavy girl. Say hi. Yeah, she pee peed this morning on the patio. And before I noticed it, she had walked all in it. So, her little swimming pool in the back has got clean water in it. And we went out there and just gave our little feet a bath. Now, I'm going to show you from them draining that pool. Look. My ground is soaking wet. I may have made a big mistake, y'all. I don't know what I'm going to do. Look at this one right here. Look at that. Can you see it's dead? because it drowned it just drowned I don't know what I'm gonna do I don't you guys I really don't know what I am going to do <sighs> I guess I should have known better huh now you can see because these guys have an overload of water. I came out here this morning and um, stand up, baby. The water's so wet, it's not holding him up. The dirt's not holding him up. And um, this is another place where my long surgical tweezers come in so handy because look i can get way down in there i love those things y'all and i made fun of them sweetie if you watch this video um i'm sorry for making fun of your little gift but when i first got them they were kind of comical look all of my plants Look at that. Loose. Because the water is soaked. Look, these are falling over. Oh, gosh, y'all. What am I going to do? Now, see my hens and chicks? They're not too affected. A little bit they are. What am I going to do? If we have heavy rain, or they drain that stinking swimming pool again, I guess what I can do is just wait and watch. Now, these seem to be the ones that have been affected the most. 
and this little guy was over here so I'm gonna have to keep an eye on them um, that one I had to pull leaves off that were just soaked and then they were drying up of course so I don't know y'all I may have to take my black things out of there and watch the other stuff really close and see if it's going to survive. Now, if they had drained that pool for cleaning, that chlorine would kill everything in here. It would just kill all my stuff. I should take all of it out and have a big bonfire right here. Ugh. I'm just, oh my gosh, that's what Hazel does. Um, I don't know what to do, y'all. I'm so disappointed. I didn't even notice that soil being all wet until this morning. I guess it's all wet all the way under there, but I can't see it because it's under the rocks. If y'all have any ideas, please let me know. I don't want to lose my babies over there. But I think the dark purple or the black ones are not going to do good. And I will have to relocate them. I'm sorry, y'all. I can't even... The sun, I can't see where I've got the camera pointed. My flowers seem to be doing okay. Oh, let me see. This video, oh gosh, this video is getting so long. But there was something I wanted to show y'all because if there is any doubt in anybody's mind, oh good, about what a genius I am, this is going to confirm it. You see my pots? I love these pots. I love that basket weave. But do you know what they are? They're hose pots. That's why the big hole is right there. Y'all, now this is how stupid I am. I thought that was easy access to water. Oh my word. And when I showed these to Stephanie, she didn't even see the tag. She said, oh, you got some hose pots. I'm like, what? Holy mackerel. Oh, well, y'all, you know, keeps me on my toes. Keeps me from being a having a big head okay miss hazel you get you some exercise baby okay y'all i'm gonna let you go and um i've done a couple of like really short things um to kind of put in between all this yard stuff but unfortunately there's a lot of this until i can get it done but um one other thing I'm going to do, um, she's probably going back in the ground, and I think he's going in the ground, because I want to plant some pretty petunias or something in my beautiful pink pots. Oh my gosh, is that a crack? Oh, thank goodness. It's a shadow. Scared me to death. I did have three of these, and I broke one. Okay, y'all. My gloves are over there getting a suntan. So, I'll let you go, and I'll talk to you later. And if anybody has any suggestions for my uh, succulent pit... If you would let me know, it'd be much appreciated.
I'll talk to y'all later. Oh, my bird bath needs water. I'm so sad my hummingbirds are not here. Do something fun. And please, please be safe. Talk to y'all later. Bye now. You can turn off now. <laughs>